Beautiful outside today. The sunshine's back after yesterday's rainstorm. Yeah, most of the county saw rain, even hail, and some of our mountain communities you can see got a dusting of snow. The CBS 8 Shannon Handy was at Mount Laguna with a look for us. Carlo and Heather, what an absolutely gorgeous day up here. As you can see, last night's storm brought a fresh layer of snow, which is the first time this has happened since around New Year's. Now, while there were chain requirements last night and this morning, those have since been lifted. And with no crowds midweek, those who made the trip today say it's a real treat. This was the scene along Sunrise Highway in an area known for sledding. It wasn't crowded, unlike what we've seen before after a fresh snowstorm. Now, as I mentioned, the roads are clear, but last night they were reportedly pretty icy, but the snow plows were out and had the roads clear by mid morning. Still, the weather did force some school districts to shut down for the day, including the Julian Elementary and High School districts, as well as Spencer Valley. Meanwhile, Warner Unified had a two hour late start. This is, of course, quite different from the warm and dry conditions that have stuck around for a while now. Visitors and business owners we spoke to say it's a nice change. We are a group of homeschool science co-op members, and we've been learning all about our backcountry and birds this year. And we saw snow was the first half without an opportunity. We couldn't pass it for our kids. Economically, it helps, yes, and it's going to be a terrible summer if we don't get some moisture in these trees. So. It's a good thing for the fire for this summer too. The temperatures are warming up, so keep that in mind. This snow may not be around for much longer if you decide to come. And as always, if you're going to pull over and do some sledding, you need a permit, which will cost you $5. You can buy one online or one of the local businesses. Also, locals always want people to know to stay off private properties and bring your trash with you when you go home.